Hello, and we're back with some Divine Knockout, and we're playing the Fiery Ymir. Now, I know I haven't played Divine Knockout or made a video in a very long time, so bear with me. I'm going to be struggling. At least that's what I'm expecting with this game. And I'm starting off with Ymir because he's one of my favorite characters. Sadly, we got teamed up with an Amaterasu as our enemy for the first game of the day, which is going to be pretty difficult if you ask me. Well, it really depends on the player itself. Now, hopefully they do fix the server lag. I did see they were actually tweeting on their official Twitter account, which actually made me happy. I think it's a good sign. That's how I want to be positive that, you know, we're finally getting some form of communication. Hopefully we get some big news before the end of the year because this game has so much potential and I'd be very sad to see it die. Another thing to note as well, I'm trying to finish off the Noob to Pro series, getting every character to level 20. My Thor one is finished. I just need one more clip to finish it off there with the level 20 skin and then I can release that next and hopefully get that nice sweet golden ice cream skin for Ymir as he's almost level 20. Now, Amaterasu is somehow still alive, but that wall came up at the perfect moment and that heavy attack knocked her out of bounds giving me that first round victory i feel pretty strong right now the once once the internet holds up because we all know it's very difficult to play when you're lagging out or have to deal with any form of wi-fi issues now look at that the combo comes off this amaterasu is already at 60 percent now if i did the combo properly honestly probably would have been at 80 percent which could have let us knock him out a little earlier so we haven't gotten hit yet and there she comes in with some nice ratatata or should i say just slice and dice because that makes more sense since she's not really using a gun right there coming at the perfect moment she sadly uses her comb i'm oh, sorry her counter move the same moment i use my frost bread, which allowed me to get frozen oh i got hit by the pendulum I need the pendulum deadly as ever. Nothing has really changed in those regards. A question I do have for you is what game have you been playing lately? I've also started playing Warcraft Rumble, a really nice phone game. I'm actually really enjoying it. It's a World of Warcraft take on Clash of Clans. And as you can see there, I got some really nice second round victory right there, knocking him out. It feels really good to play him here. You know what? I'm probably going to try playing Thanatos or something a little later. It seems like a good chance to play one of my favorite characters again. Or maybe Saul. I'm going to be super rusty with Saul. I know King Arthur is also fun to play, but for me, he's not always the best. Nice little attacks right there coming off from me, trying to counter him, putting the wall up, and it didn't really work. He still was able to use Sunseeker Dash straight through the wall. Going to look to see if you can get baited and come in on me. Right, perfect right there, counter. But he avoids my belly slam and collects me with the uppercut. I don't really need to worry there. Is he going to get... Ah, we both get hit with the pendulum, but I think he got the health orb. Thankfully, I didn't get hit with that hold heavy at a better angle, or that probably would have knocked me out. Using the perfect freeze right there, putting up the wall. We're going to increase some damage right there. He did get a chance to dodge, but... He wasn't able to dodge that massive amount of damage that I was about to hit him off right there. I thought he fell Ooh, perfect right there, and that did not eliminate him. So he's going to be able to come back on, looking to see if I can get him. Before. Oh, he j okay, gave up. I'll take it. That is my first victory of the day, and we're going on to game number two. Facing off against a Thanatos and a Divine Knockout Alpha player, E-C... Oh, sorry. E-C-E-G-S. Why am I mixing that up? My vocabulary is struggling right now. So we're going to go in here and I'm avoiding as much attacks. I already know this is a very good player, so it's going to be interesting. Plus, it's a Thanatos. I actually do not know how to avoid that Thanatos trick where it's the one two combo where you're just doing an endless light attacks coming off with the speed demon build. I have a build guide. Now, that's another thing. If you're new to Divine Knockout, just remember this is a nice side game. Don't take it too seriously and try to main it right now. It doesn't really make sense to, but just have fun where you can. And I think I'm actually surprised I'm still in the game. I thought I would have been it avoid oh no i was trying to jump back and avoid but he did come in at the right moment landing some sweet sweet light air heavy attack sorry allowing him to knock me out of the ground giving that nice gg emote always a great way to start off the game right there nice belly slam in mid air and i was able to avoid the sight and dodge right there i feel like i'm lagging a little bit and it's not working out in my favor but i'm still gonna try i had this game where i was so laggy i literally had to think two or three seconds ahead of time so I can land moves. It was really interesting. And I was able to somehow pull off the victory. That did not work out in my favor. The air attack came in with Thanatos, knocking me into my own wall, knocking me out. I do get the frozen here, which will work out. Sadly, no walls. So I'm going to come in with some light attacks, come in with a hold heavy, knocking him back, actually eliminating him from the round, giving me first round victory. So now we're tied up 1-1, which is actually fantastic 
Now, I will say we both stood in the air there trying to land some attacks. Thankfully, I didn't get hit. We tried it again and we clashed backing up there with a nice... No, actually, wait. I Sorry. I didn't even dodge that. I got hit, which healed him. And now I'm in a very dangerous situation. And I used my one defensive very wrong, which now is leaving me empty. So I'm going to jump up here. Shouldn't have to worry. I shouldn't have to worry about the Thanatos' re-engage. And as you can see there, I'm kind of struggling to do commentary. I haven't done it in a little while, so it's kind of interesting. And you can see I'm actually losing the vulnerability game right here. He's looking around. I do not get hit with that perfect. Still in the game right there, and I could get knocked out at any second. I need to avoid his next attack. I do have my dodge. Get behind, and he uses his mobility, engaging again with some nice side attacks. He dodges out, trying to avoid him. Get the belly slam off into my icicle, which does does not land i'm kind of worrying right here but we're gonna pop out a heavy attack see if he comes in and catch him with my frost breath that would be picture perfect right here see if i can get my wall increase his damage oh no my attack missed he was able to dodge and he collects the health orb but i do get in with the hold heavy attack now he's at 84 we're not too far off but i still need to be very careful and i say that because i could be knocked out he could be knocked out we're in deadly range he does have his ultimate up as well i need to be careful avoid avoid oh no i got stuck by the bench which caused me to get caught out in that dark fader choke i also clicked my ultimate to see if i could get in the snowball fast enough because i realized what was going on and it didn't work out as planned now i'm having a lot of fun commentating again i'm just having a lot of fun making videos in general it's a really good thing that i've missed out thankfully i got a little more free time so i'm trying my best to get back into the daily routine and we're not just going to be doing divine knockoff we're going to be doing a lot of other games hopefully in the future or should i say right now because let's be honest it's nice to play a lot of different games might even play some guild wars pvp which is something i've been doing a lot of lately but right now as it stands it's divine knockout on warcraft rumble i did land some attacks there and thankfully kiting back just enough to dodge oh no and as i said that i got hit but he walked straight into my icicle into the aerial attack by my belly now where is he going to re-engage or is he just going to hover down he does re-engage that is something he should not have done into the hold heavy. He dodges through and I dodge again, but I get hit with his last light attack there. Thankfully, I didn't get caught with that because it would have healed him. He's actually doing really well. Thankfully, I survived. I wasn't knocked out right there. Going to collect this right here with my big booty slam. The vulnerability is kind of getting even out and I know his ultimate is up, so I need to be very careful. Into the ice, he uses ultimate. I should be able to outrange it into some nice light attacks, knocking him out of the arena, coming up at my wall. He's going to re-engage and he does actually to hit me i'm gonna drop onto my snowball right here just to buy myself some time for my cooldowns to come back up you see he easily dodged it as yamir's ultimate that is something that definitely hasn't changed yamir's ultimate is very easy to avoid but do not get caught and that was actually a picture perfect heavy attack which gave us the victory tying up the score 2-2 this game is actually going on pretty long i wonder if i'm going to be able to pull off the victory or he is either way it's a nice gg i again turned too early a little rusty i would say coming in with that belly slam avoiding him right there look at that frost breath and he simply avoids he's gonna catch me with that re-engage no i think it glitched out there at the wi-fi because i know i dodged but it didn't think i was out of dodge range for that attack and he's at 69 percent 69 and i'm at four. oh no actually he's tied it up right there i'm now at 69 trying to get back on we both tried to do some aerial attacks i was just trying to evade as much as possible into some nice side attacks he's a little higher vulnerability but we're basically the same where is he going to re-engage if i was him i would just hover down don't even re-engage and he does but i do miss my light attacks on the recoil right there thankfully i put up that wall or i would have gone towards him which he would have easily been able to probably end the game right there now my frost breath is coming up he's still in the air light attacks knocking him back which works out i have to use my frost breath perfectly or i can be eliminated nice belly snap into the dodge and ice breath i misused it there and i think this is gg here well it was a great time being back in divine knockout